Hey guys, what's up? It's Ruby and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be dressing like my favorite snacks because what else is there to do during quarantine? I've already done painting, I've already done baking, I'm running out of ideas. So this was the most logical next step. <laughs> mm. Enjoy the video. So the first snack is my very most complete ever favorite food and that is salt and vinegar chips. I eat way too much of these, I have such an unhealthy addiction. So the main colors in a salt and vinegar chip packet are pink, yellow and red. For my top I've gone with this yellow knit tank and I've chosen these bright pink pants from Revolve which pretty much perfectly match the color of the packet. My bag is a super cute 90s inspired mini bag again in pink. I've added this cap since it has some red lettering and my Cardi and Chunky sneakers in this raspberry shade complete this look. Next we're moving on to some chocolate. So Twix is like memories of my childhood. How good is Twix though? And how much do I look like a Twix bar here? Like am I for real? I've nailed this one. So the key colors in a Twix wrapper are red, gold, and white. For gold, I've kind of decided to sub the next closest alternative, which is like a mustard color. So both my crop top and my cardi are in this shade of mustard. My pants are these skinny fit trousers, which I thrifted quite a while ago, and they fit like a dream. For my sneakers, I've chosen my Nike Cortez, since the colors are kind of perfect here. My bag is this red one from Anine Bing, and have I made you crave a Twix yet? So the third snack is pizza shapes. Okay, so the big question is, are you a pizza shape person or a barbecue shape person? Let me know in the comments below. In my opinion, barbecue is good, like I will eat it, but pizza is life, like pizza is the best. This is one of my fave outfits in this video because I'm really into purple at the moment. The pizza shapes pack has the colors purple, red, and yellow. My skirt covers the purple and red components and my top is this one in yellow, the same as the first look. I've also chosen this oversized purple shirt to add some more purple into the mix. And my bag is this fancy red one from before from Anin Bing. And for my sneakers, how could I not choose my purple converse to finish off this look? Next up is grain waves. So I have to start by saying that grain waves are really, really different in different countries. Like they're not consistent at all. In Australia, they are so good, really crispy and crunchy with the perfect amount of artificial sour cream and chive flavoring. But in London, they literally taste like cardboard. They're terrible. Anyways, here is my green grain waves outfit. This was a pretty easy one since it's basically green and white. I've kept my look mostly green and I've added in a dash of white with my top to match the aesthetic of the packet. Okay, so now we're back to some chocolate. Let me just grab it from my pantry. But to be honest, I don't like Dream. I just don't like white chocolate in general. But I had this cute blue outfit and I wanted to show you. So here it is. My top is from Beginning Boutique and I really like this style of like crop top times cardigan combo thing. My skirt is this really cute checkered one from Princess Polly and I've chosen a white bag and shoes to match the colors of the Dream wrapper. Next up we have Milka. Now is this not the most aesthetically pleasing chocolate you've ever seen? Plus, you know I wanted to create a purple look, so here it is. I'm wearing this cute mini dress and it is just the perfect shade of lilac. Along with this, I'm wearing this purple bomber, which is one of my very first thrift finds when I moved to London. I'm actually wearing this inside out because it matches the Milka colors better this way. My bag is this really cute one from Hibisk and I've chosen my Nike Verona sneakers to complete this very Milka-y look. Let me be the one. 
So guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this strange and weird and highly, highly unnecessary video that I've just filmed. Um, make sure to like and subscribe for great new videos like this coming to you soon. Hope you're staying safe, hope you're staying sane, hope you're staying inside. Hopefully, hopefully we can all go outside again soon. Enjoy the outside world. Go and have a brunch, go to a restaurant, all those things that we took for granted. <sighs> anyway, hopefully we'll all be able to get to do those amazing things soon. And yeah, I'll see you all in my next video. Bye. Let me love